Hi everyone. In this video, we are going to demonstrate how to add a menu in an email template with OnLayer. Let's begin. You can see a fashion email template here. We'll add a menu under the logo of this template. So, we'll simply drag and drop our menu feature towards the template. Once done, we'll click on the menu and all of its properties will display in front of us. The first property that you can see here is of menu item. This is where you decide the categories for your menu. For this template, the first category of our menu will be men. And in the action type, we'll add its URL. Then, we'll set a target for the same tab. You can choose the target according to your choice. Similarly, we'll add three more categories to this menu. These categories are of women, kids and about us. We'll add their respective URLs and select targets for each of them. Like we did earlier. Next property that we have here is of styles. And the first option of this property is font of the menu. So, we'll click on the fonts and select a desirable one. For this template, we went for Helvetica. Next, we have font size. We selected font size 14 for this menu, but you can choose that, as per your choice. Moving on, you can select the color of the menu's text according to your choice. The same way, you can select a color for the link, by adding your desired color code. For this template's menu, we went for a camel color, to suit the template's colors. Next we'll select a center alignment for this menu. You can choose any alignment according to your choice. Further, we'll select a layout type. For this template's menu we selected the horizontal layout. Then next option is of a separator. Adding this is completely up to you. For this menu, we'll add a vertical slash to separate each category. Then, we have some padding options. You can adjust the padding from all sides according to your choice, but for this menu, we'll stick with the default padding. And with that our menu is now ready on the desktop. However, the mobile version of your menu will require a few adjustments. To do so, we'll click on the mobile icon. The first option that we have is the font size, and we'll let that remain 14 here as well. As for layout, we'll switch it to vertical. It's praiseworthy how OnLayer's editor allows you to make necessary changes in desktop and mobile version. Because if we see the menu in vertical layout here the desktop version will still show us a horizontal layout, and we were done. Now, we'll preview the template, and see how the menu looks on the desktop, and mobile version one by one. Perfect! So this is how you add a menu in an email template with OnLayer. Wasn't that seamless and easy? So what are you thinking about? Start designing your email templates with OnLayer.